What is going on guys, it's Lauren and today <laughs> we're going to be reacting to the whole of the Total Zanarchy album by Lil Zan. New album, I've heard good reviews and I've heard bad reviews. Some songs on it I have obviously heard because they've been around for a long freaking time. But a lot of them I haven't heard. I did try and listen yesterday in the car and I wasn't going to make this video. But my Apple Music was being a bitch and wasn't working. So yeah. Before we get into the video, don't forget I do music promotions. So if you're interested in them, then don't forget to hit me up. And uh, <laughs> yeah. Also, I'm actually looking for someone at the moment who uh, mixes and masters and like produces and makes beats and stuff. So if you do, then email me some like samples or examples. I don't know, samples, examples, same thing. Down below, my email address is down below. And yeah, let's get straight into this. So the first one is. I'm going to skip the ones I already know. First one is Who Am I? So I'm just going to go like a little bit into it and listen. Right, let's, let's, let's go. I feel like he's overdoing like the talk about Zans recently. Like, did he even ever used to do Zans? Like, if he did, then I'm sorry. But I feel as though he's just overdoing it. Like, Zan, 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 Zan. Like, I, so far I don't know this one. I've heard like 20 seconds of it. I just feel like it's too mumbly. Like, I know he's like a mumble rapper or whatever. Like, he's not even a mumble rapper. To I don't even know what he is. It's just, I don't know. He's a sound clapper. But like, I, I honestly just. <laughs> I just don't feel like, you know, I don't know, I just don't think he's going to be one of the ones who actually stays, you know? I don't know. Next one is TikTok featuring 2 James. Alright, okay, let's try and get to this. They haven't said when, like, ah, oh, here's a timestamp. Cool, we got this. Okay, so 4.44. Two, three, four. This is TikTok, by the way. I just didn't like it. I I just didn't like it. Yeah, it's been. I think the bass was too much. Like, I don't know. It's just. It's just too repetitive. I, I can't deal with it. I actually can't. The next one is diamonds. Okay, let's go. I think he's like, I don't know, I thought Alan was pretty whack. He's pretty much, I don't know, it was too like, he was too hyper, like high P, like he was too like upbeat and like fucking like sunshiny and happy for the beat. Like the beat was like, it should have been like a lower kind of tone, you know what I mean? I don't know. Okay, next one is Saved by the Bell. Um, I keep seeing like, he puts these like animations on Instagram about like, and it's like him and he's like Shh, sh, sh, doing like his schoolwork or whatever. I feel as though this one's gonna be about that, but I don't know, let's go. Um, I don't mind that one, it wasn't that bad, but it's hard to understand like what he's saying. Like I understand when he says I was saved by the bell and like father's bitch or whatever he says, but other than that it was a tiny tiny bit too confusing for me. I don't know. Next one is Moonlight with Charlie XCX or CXC, I don't know how you say it, but yeah. The more light, she said she felt the more right. She said it's everything right. We drunk up off that moonshine. We look up at the starlight. 
That was weird. It just went like boom and just stopped. Hold on. That one, I don't know. I like the beat. His flow is a tiny bit off though, I feel. Um, you can ju judge me for saying that, but I don't know. I know there's going to be loads of little Daniel haters in the comments like, Oh my god, just that's a fucking hoe. Like, get the fuck off YouTube, you fat. How can you not like this? But you know, like, a reaction is here for an opinion. And like, I've given my opinion, so yeah, deal with it. But, um, yeah, next one is Shine Hard featuring Ray. Okay, let's try this one. I kind of like this. I liked it at the beginning, but I think it just kind of went a little bit boring. I don't know. I feel like it just went a bit boring. Next one is round here. Yeah, I can't really feel that to be honest. Um, I don't know, it was a little bit too fast, I think. Mm, I don't know, I'll probably give the whole thing like a re-listen because obviously I'm only listening to small parts of it at the moment, but it's just like a first off opinion. Next one is basic, Clay. Yeah. Yeah. It just doesn't sound like him at all in this. He just keeps rapping about like the same shit. Like it's just recycled and it's all just so similar and so repetitive. And like I feel as if he switched it up a bit, he'd get a lot further in life. Like with his old like rap career. Next one is deceived. I mean, to be honest, I didn't mind it. It wasn't like obviously my favourite. My favourite out of all of them is probably Wake Up or Slingshot. Like, I really like Slingshot, but I heard all the others. Obviously, there's Betrayed Slingshot Fart and the Betrayed Remix. I didn't like the Betrayed Remix either because I felt as though his part was like too sped up, if you know what I mean. Like, I like the vibe of that last one, but I feel as though it was too. It was just too repetitive. Same as the other stuff. It was just talking about the same shit over and over again. But I mean, I can't really say anything. I'm not a fucking rapper. But yeah, I mean, hopefully the next album he drops is a bit different because that was kind of repetitive. I kind of got a little bit bored. But I don't know. Anyway, guys, let me know what you guys think down in the comments. Uh, guys, lots, and I'll see you soon for another video. Bye. Blame on me, no shame on you. No, you can't hide the truth. I'ma slide right through your roof. My papa pillar too. Let them hate, we chop the deuce. Fuck that, we getting loose. Pussy sweeter than some juice. I slurp it like a snake. She a naughty type on a weekend.